Hey guys, today we are back. We're Crystal. Uh, oh my gosh, Crystal goes so crazy with that. But yes, we are back at Cow Play Cow Moo. And this is a different location than when we were at last time. We are actually in the basement of SunTech City and they have another arcade down here. Yeah, so we're gonna get to the arcade in just one second. We're gonna go up there to the claw machines in just one second, not just yet. First, we're gonna check out this over here. They have this goblet toss for Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. And Crystal is gonna play it and hopefully win. If she can get it into one of the color ones back there, she'll win a uh, different prize on the wall. We actually have done a video for this already. It hasn't gone up yet, but it will go up shortly after this video. It is a fun game. We enjoy it. And where have you ever seen goblet toss like this at an arcade? Come on. Come on. Oh man, that was a waste of a ball, Chris. Come on. Oh, come on, Chris. You're wasting the balls here. This is your last ball. Yes, green, green. Oh man. Yeah, this is a really fun game and you guys will get to see how we did in a future video. But we're not gonna play any more of this right now. So now we're gonna check out the actual arcade. We do wanna thank Cow Play Cow Moo for sponsoring this video. Thank you guys. This Hungry Hungry Hippos right here is so loud. Every time we were up front playing the uh, gym pushers, we would hear that game nonstop. It's so loud, guys. Hey, Pirate Legend, that's a fun game, remember? Yeah, we played that game, it's a fun one. This right here is cool. I'm pretty sure we showed this in the last Cow Play Cow Move video we did, where it's the, uh, it's SpongeBob. It's SpongeBob um, Red Zone Rush. Yeah, that's, that's fun. I like how they redid that one. What else do they have here? Oh my gosh, look at this dragon game. Dragon Orb. Oh yeah, this is a cool looking game, guys. So, this game is very similar to, uh, what was that other game we played, Planet Tickets? But it has like an extra thing going on here. Try a couple it's plays. Cool. Yeah, it's, it's better than the Planet Ticket one because this has more going on. Yeah. So first up, she has to grab a ball. And it's constantly Yeah, it's constantly moving around. And different balls have different values. Yeah. Get a ball, get a ball. Ooh, we didn't get a ball. But once she gets a ball, it, depending on the color, so she kind of wants to get uh, all these different colors because it activates a special feature. Yeah. But she also wants to spell out big bonus. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, get a ball, get a ball, get a ball. Get a ball, any ball. Any ball will do? Oh, oh no. Get Look at the size of that SpongeBob. That is the big one, SpongeBob. That thing, well, it has a base, but that thing is taller than me, guys. It's so big. Oh, man. Oh, and here's the, uh, the SpongeBob coin pusher with all the, yeah, that's what I was saying, yeah. with all the cute cars, the traveling SpongeBob. Hey, we haven't played this in a long time. Try playing it. It's Jet Ball Alley. I think the last time we played this was in Australia, right? Yeah, it was in Australia. That was years ago. All right, so it takes eight coins, Chris. Yeah, it says it right there in the back. Yeah, so she has to put eight coins in. So I don't remember when we played it. Was it in Australia, actually? It was, right? No, no, I think that was a skee-ball version. I think the last time we played this was Yes, at IAPA. So it's got like a 3D effect back there, like a hologram. And she's trying to make like, I think she wants to, um, oh wait, I actually didn't light that up. I thought, I was about to say, I, th I think she wants to connect them. Oh gosh. Oh wait, see, it says you connected them, so now you want to get that left red one. Hey, she got it. Keep going, you're on a time limit. Yeah, you only have 36 seconds. So she's trying to, ooh, she didn't make anything there. Oh, redo. Yes, get that bottom one, that bottom one. No, you want that bottom one, Chris, the bottom one. Oh no, you gotta get the bottom one. No, you're hitting it too hard. Oh, you almost had it there. She still has time. No. So she gets unlimited balls, it looks like. Oh, this is cool. So if you get 2,000, you get a bonus score. Or something, I don't know, it says 2,000 back there. Come on, Chris, look at the 200. Oh, time's up. Oh, yep, right at the end you get it. How much did you get? Your total score was 470. Hey, 47 tickets, not too bad. Oh, what is this? It's like a down the clown, but it's like down the cans. It's called Cola Party, because they're sodas. Are you gonna give it a try? Well, actually, we have some free balls here. Let's just see if we can knock some down. Did you? I'm trying it. Oh, I got one. 
Okay, let's see. Oh gosh, yeah, it's not, it's not like they break, right? Yeah. Right, I don't think we're gonna play that game. Because we, we play Down the Clown all the time. But that's still cool to see a different version of Down the Clown. What else do we have here? Hey, this is a game we've never played before. What are you, what are you doing it? I don't know. I, that looks kind of complicated for right now. Whoa, that's a high jackpot, 4,840. Ooh, the prize shop. We're gonna make it over there eventually, but not right this second. What does Crystal see over here? Oh, the Tsum Tsum machine, yeah. This is a fun game. We actually played it before, and you wanna collect the cards. The cards are different. So if you're used to seeing it, you might be thinking, hey, isn't this Willy Wonka? No, this is a Tsum Tsum coin pusher, okay? It's not Willy Wonka at all. Hey, Dream Castle, oh yeah. This is a fun game too. Because you collect cards as well, but this is for Disney princesses. There's a, tr a train going all the way across over there. Oh, Space Invaders, play that. We actually have not seen this since IAPA a couple years ago, I believe. All right, so take six coins. Let's see if she can actually get the uh, jackpot on this. It's a thousand. You need one more coin, Chris. Yeah, it says in the back screen how many you put in. All right, instructions. Protect the bunkers. Shoot the invaders. Shoot them. Oh, this is cool. Shoot the big one, Chris, the big one. The big one. No, you're not, you're shooting above it. There you go. Shoot that, shoot that green thing. So Crystal's aiming with the balls. You're not, you don't aim with the balls, you aim with that little flashy thing. <laughs> Stop aiming with the balls, aim with the flashy thing. No, the flashy thing, oh gosh. Go down, the flashy thing. Come on, Crystal. Oh my gosh, Crystal's finding this very difficult. I'm finding this entirely too difficult to watch. Shoot that thing, shoot that thing. Yes, she got it. Oh, what the heck is that? Oh, she's, she's getting it now. Oh, actually, no, she's not. I thought she was. Okay, now the bunker. Oh, you, I think you lost. You didn't even make it past stage one. No, you're, you're not shooting in the right spot. You're shooting with the balls. You're oh, wait, I think you gotta shoot these. You're get, your game's not over, actually. I think you actually wanna aim at those, right? I think so. Yeah, like that. I think. Yeah, shoot them. Shoot them down here. Shoot them. Just shoot. Focus on one. Oh, no. I think that's what you have to do. I don't, because the one time we did play was at IAPA. I'm actually going to give this a try because I want to see if I can do better than Chris. So now Angel's going to give it a try. I got to, my score was 3,040 and I thought I was doing pretty well. I'm going to show you just how bad you were doing. Okay, show me. <laughs> Come on, don't let me down. Stay to it. Oh, oh my gosh, Angel, you're killing it already. Okay, maybe I was playing the game wrong. <laughs> Oh, 
after that easy jackpot. I don't even need to play anymore. Crystal, can you drop it, drop it? This game was at the expo, I remember. So in this game, what she has to do is, this arm is gonna come towards us. She has to press the button perfectly to get the ball into that hole. Oh, a little too early. You'll still get something, right? Oh gosh, you have five tickets. That's actually the worst. So back there, it shows you what the different hole colors are, um, how much they're worth in tickets. She wants to hit that center star. Oh, a little. That was just a little too early. If you can get in there, Chris, that's a thousand tickets, okay? All right, I think it's ready. Oh yeah, it's ready. Here we go. Oh my, I cannot believe this. Okay, we could probably play this game all day. But I, I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna get it. Is it actually ready? Okay, I thought I, I thought it was ready. I was about to say, Crystal, we're about to play again, actually. So Crystal's going this way. Hey, play play this one. Clutch shot or clutch shoot. Sorry. So we played this one at the uh, expo as well. It's so cool to see all these games, you know, out at an arcade. So these are all games that we've seen. Oh, I think it's ready. It's spinning up here. I think she has to get it right perfectly into there. Ooh, that was not quite perfect. But you also, I think, want to light all these basketballs up to get the bonus. The bonus is 215 currently right there. So if you make it into the clutch, you only get 30? I think you only get 30. Okay. Oh, you made it! And you got a one. Oh, the combos are back here. But what counts is, oh, so you gotta get it. Oh, so all those count as combos. And that's how you get this? That's a lot of combos to get. Oh, you got another one! And look, now it's worth 60, or you got 60, now it's worth 90. Oh, that's cool. Can you get another combo? What the? Crystal knows the timing! Crystal knows the timing. She knows the timing now. You got this, Chris. Get another combo. What am I missing? The combo I don't know, but let's find out. Oh, oh I, thought, I was like, what the heck? You put a coin in, right? All right, she has to put another coin in. Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see if it resets. Oh, it does? Holy moly, that would be, so, that's like impossible. That would be such a hard game to win on. Like, what in the world? Did we play this before? I know we played it, but have we played it on camera? So in this game, what you're gonna do is you wanna push the shoot button right here. I'm gonna try to do it, okay? And I wanna get past this little goal. That guy's not that little, he's pretty big. Because if you get, if you get past it, you get like bonus tickets or balls or something. What the heck? What the heck? What the heck? What the heck? There we go. Oh, it actually does disappear. That's where it does it. I, I forgot about that. So every time I make it, I gotta look up there. His hand is too big. Only a couple more. I'm done. Come on. What the heck? How can I roll? What the heck? do that. That is the world's best goalie, guys. I promise you that. That guy is the best goalie ever. This is a fun game, too. We played this in the past, where you gotta get the uh, the uh, chip ticket things over. That's a really fun one. That's a, that's a fun game. Oh, not Ticket Coaster. Not Ticket Coaster. All right, let's see. Can Crystal get something high value? Oh, oh, we, yes. But you actually need them all. You actually need them all. Because if you, if you light them all up, you get this super bonus. Yeah, so Mr. Krabs is 200, SpongeBob is 200, and Sandy at the end is 200. And they are the smallest pieces. You have to get, oh no, no, get Patrick. Yes, you're lighting them all up. All you need now is uh, Mr. Krabs, Plankton, Squidward, and Sandy. Can you get them all? So she waiting for the other train. Oh, I don't know about that one. I hope so, but I don't know. Oh, no, no, that's gonna get a duplicate. No, you, yeah, you don't need Patrick. You need to get some in the front. So go a lot earlier. Oh, I think it went too late. Yeah, you're going for the back still, it looks like. Yeah. You already have Pearl, though. We don't need, oh, try to get one in the front, Chris. You have to go a lot earlier, so don't drop yet. Oh, no, you don't, I said don't drop. No, that's, oh, it is, you're right. I'm sorry, you're right. But we already have Gary. So Plankton and Squidward should be the next easiest ones to get, right? Oh, I wish. Oh! No! Oh, you got Mr. Krampus 200! 
Yes, so he's one of the hard ones because his little sliver on the train is so tall, small compared to the rest. Oh, you gotta keep going, Chris. This is actually the first time we've played this game outside of the expo. I know. All right, so try to get plankton. Do you know the timing? Is that good? I don't know about that one. Oh, I don't know about this one. Oh, we still need we still need Sandy though in the back. A couple more times, Chris, because I know we can play this all day. I, I just know Crystal can play this all day. Oh gosh. You're getting closer to the back though, but I think we're done for that. Or we're done with this game for now. We can play a few other games like this Stitch one. We did play this already. I just don't know if the video went up yet. So let's assume that video did not go up yet. In this game, what you want to do is you want to get the balls that come down here. You want to use the buttons right here. It like spins these around. Yeah, it spins these around, and you want to shoot the balls back into right there and right there. They're the goal. So you're kind of playing like pinball in a way. So let me start the game. I'm going to do the right side, you do the left side. Sound good? I'm pressing start. Here we go. All right, so Crystal can spin that left one, I can spin the right one. Come on. Come on, we want to hit it in goal. Goal. Oh, we're not getting goals. Yeah, you got one. Oh, you got Oh, it didn't count the other one, though. So every time you get it into goal, you'll notice. You can do both buttons, Chris. So um, do both buttons. So every time she makes it into gold, a ball will come out right here, a yellow ball. And every time she gets three, it does like a bonus game. Crystal, what are you doing? Oh, you got one, you got one. So a ball's gonna come out, a big ball. Oh, come on, come on. I like this game, this game's fun. Oh, you got another one. You need one more over there on the left side. Come on. Oh, you still have four more. I want to get a bonus game. Get a bonus game, Chris. One more on the left. Chris was button smashing like never before. Is that it? Yeah, I think that's it. So these yellow balls, every time one of the yellow balls comes all the way over here, because it's like a little pusher. It pushes over here. You see this, this, and this? If the yellow ball lands and it hits like a little trigger, it will give her a card. Yeah. And there's cards to collect in the set. There's like so many of them. Yeah, this is a fun game. I wish she would have got a, a bonus or a bonus game because then the ball comes down here and hits right here and does this thing over here. We actually did do a video on this. I'm assuming it did not go up, but it might have gone up. They also have carnival games inside of this arcade. Like, come on. So the poo one is kind of like outside the arcade, but it's still part of the arcade. But inside they have another goblet toss, but this one is for Zoom Zooms. We did do a video on this as well too. I don't know if it went up because who knows when these videos are going up. Crystal has a few balls, she's gonna try. So depending on which color she gets in, uh, gets one of the balls into, is a uh, zoom zoom that she'll get. So in the back, there's like a menu back there. So if she gets into red, she gets a, she has to choose out of a certain, uh, like six designs. In the green, it's like another six designs and so on and so forth. But if she gets in that one right there, that is the rainbow one. That is the best one to make it. She's gonna do one more ball. Oh, that's okay. There's another game I want to show. This one. In this game, what you do is you put a ball in here and you want it to roll down and land into one of the lit up circles on there. This game looks easy, but I promise you guys, it is super hard. So hard. So we did do a video on it, so we kind of got some uh, technique to it. You kind of want to put the ball in there slowly and like really slow. Oh, oh, oh man. That was crazy close. All right, she only has like five balls, I think. So she's only gonna try a few. We do have a video on it, like I said. Wait, oh my gosh, that was so close. No, it bounced off the wall and came back and you missed that part. Crystal was already dra um, grabbing the next ball. That was a very close one. Yeah, she's doing it nice and slow. She doesn't want to go too fast, but not too slow either. Wait, yes, oh my gosh, she just got it. Oh my gosh. So now that she got one in there, she gets to pick any prize in the back. Any prize in the back. Oh wait, which one are you gonna get, Chris? Uh, for me, get the anger one. I'm pretty mad. Or wait, uh, no. I don't know. I'm just, I just like that one because I'm so excited. Uh, maybe get Woody. Uh, yes. Which one do you want, actually? Oh my gosh, I cannot believe you did. You have two balls. Okay, let's try this one. Although this might be your lucky one. Oh, come on. She has two balls left. Can't she win two? I'm doing a goblet toss. It's up to you. Yeah. What do you want to do? Okay, she's going to do, 
So you're gonna do two balls on goblet toss. All right. I cannot believe you did that, Chris. Oh my, that is so crazy. All right, so she's going way over there. I'm just gonna come right here. Can she get a win over here too? She has one last ball. Rainbow! A rainbow? Yeah. So I didn't even get a chance to explain what you win over here because Crystal decided to go ahead and win. But just getting it into one of the circles gets you any of these prizes in the back. And Crystal did it. Yeah, she's scanning the code over there. Yeah, to get somebody to come over here. That is so awesome though. Do you want Forky? I know you like Forky. You get whatever you want, Chris. Yeah, we'll just look at it and then we'll come back and you'll see what we got. So Crystal decided to get the Nemo. That is so awesome, Chris. What the heck? How did, what in the world? You weren't doing bad, you were doing good. Like, I mean, we haven't even made it to the claw machines yet, guys. So the arcade section, like I said earlier, is separate from the claw machine section. The claw machine section is like right, you can actually see them. They're right up there. We're gonna do a few more games, I think, in the arcade, and then we're gonna head up to the claw machines. I still cannot believe that Crystal just won that. I'm so like, I'm shocked. Oh, great, hey, we saw this game a long time ago. So in this game, I believe it drops a ball up there, and then you can do something with rotating something. Oh, you can move that down here, okay. Come on, get it, get it, get it, get it. Get it, no, keep spinning it. Oh, man, what? Oh, I didn't realize you can move the bonus. I knew there was a wheel down here, but I didn't know what that, I didn't know what it did. But now I know, okay. So if she gets into the bonus, yeah, put all your prizes down, Chris. If she can get into the wheel, that'll be 520 tickets. All right, here it comes. It's coming down the grid. It's right there in the middle. Spin it, spin it faster, yo, keep it going. Holy moly, throw it, throw it, keep going. Keep it. <laughs> what the heck? What? <laughs> oh my gosh. It's the game that never stops. Oh, wait, oh, oh, there's holes. Oh gosh, there's holes on the side. I guess they figured that someone would do that, Chris. And now you made an error. Let's get out of here. Okay, what about this game? What does this game do? So this is some kind of funky soccer game. I'm not sure what's going on here. You can really see the lights of the uh, carnival games behind us. So we got like a soccer player, right? It's really hard to see with the glare. Oh, he kicked it. He just did a multiplier times one. Oh man, getting a super prize. That's 2,000 if you get in that one. If you get super prize and a multiplier of three, that would be so crazy. That would be like 6,000 tickets. All right, where's that? Oh, she kicked it. One. Oh, it wanted to. Oh, 50. So you got 50 for that. So what does this do if you get it in it? It says three on there. There's gonna be three balls for free? You got it? Wait, extra. I, I lost it. I didn't even get to see it. What happened? So you got three times four? Yeah, three times four. Oh, I can't really see the four because there's a glare. Oh, so if you get it, it automatically is a multiplier times three, I think. Oh, yeah, two times. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, that's a fun game. But there's a big glare, so we really can't see that game. All right, is there, are there any more games we want to play down here? Crystal's itching to go upstairs to play the claw machines. I'm pretty excited to go up to the claw machines as well, but I do want to see if there's any other games down here that we can play that are kind of new or something we haven't seen. No, yes, let's show the uh, gym pushers. I'm fairly confident that we put up the videos of us playing some of these gym pushers already, but these are always fun to play because you can win. Yeah, because you can win a lot of cool stuff. I don't think we're gonna play right now because you have to dedicate yeah, you gotta dedicate yourself to play these. I think we're gonna go ahead and head up to the claw machines now. We don't have to worry about taking stairs here. We take the lazy way. Oh yeah, they have a walker later. That's at an angle and then there's a dancing crystal right there. Yeah, so that is the arcade. Look how cool that looks. That looks really neat when you're just like coming up and down, just looking at all the different games. But since we're going up, we don't care about the games anymore. We care about the claw machines. Yeah, so the first video that we actually posted of, of us here in Singapore was recorded here on these claw machines. I don't know what Crystal's gonna play. I'm trying to just like walk around a little bit. What do you wanna play, Chris? Oh gosh, she knows what she wants to play. I think it's for the Demon Slayer plush. Let's see, is it the Demon Slayer? No, it's not. Okay, I thought she was going Demon Slayer, but she didn't. Oh, she is, I knew it. I knew you were going for Demon Slayer. Because I knew where the Demon Slayer are right now. You know, by the time this video goes up, I don't even know if they'll have Demon Slayer. I don't know. All right, let's try 
All right, can she get it? Spin, 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 win, win, win. Oh, 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 it got closer. So what does sure win on this? Sure win is 28 plays. If you can win this for like half of that, you are the bomb. I think it's pretty cool that there is sure win though, because if you, are, if you really want to try, you can still get it. Yeah, like there's like a, you know what the payout is. Oh gosh. Oh, I don't know about that. Yeah, sure win is interesting, you know? Yeah. Because back home, we don't have sure win. Yeah, and if you really want that prize, you never know. Home. Yeah, you never know when it's going to pay out. Yeah. And you, like, it's an interesting uh, topic. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Oh, man. I'm oh, not yeah. Anymore. Don't play that one anymore because that's not going to work out. All right, what else do we have that you want to play, Chris? There are a lot of prizes up here, a lot of claw machines. Like, right here, you can really see the scope of the claw machines going that way, they go that way. It's just like, you can get lost in this maze. Yeah. Oh, Crystal's going for this My Melody? Yeah, my melody. Okay, My Melody. Yeah. In the headband? Oh, oh you're in the headband! Yeah. You're in the headband! Yeah. You're in the headband! Yeah. You just, yeah. what? Oh, oh, you might have to put another play on. Yeah, because it's stuck on there. You know what, put another play on, just try to shake it a little bit and try to do the same thing with another one. What the heck? What is sure win on this one? It's, um, 20, 20. 20 plays? And you're gonna get it in one. Come on, you gotta shake it faster because you're running out of time. No, 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 no. Oh gosh, don't push it further because she almost had it off. Oh, it's gonna let go. It's gonna let go, I hope. Let go. No, no, shake it a little bit. Just, oh, okay, yeah, put some more money in there. Oh, come on. She got it perfect. So this one's gonna fall off right here, Chris, if you shake it just a little bit. Oh gosh, yes! No, 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 play, play! Don't worry about that! Oh gosh, it's flashing like crazy. Can you do it into another headband? Oh my, she might clear this out. Yes, it looks good to me. If it doesn't rotate, does it rotate? Oh, it rotates quite a bit. Oh man, that was awesome. Do you know what? You have to try one more time. Try one more time because you have to get both of them because there's two different versions. There's a pink one, or sorry, a red one, and then there's this orange one. Oh my gosh. Sherwin is like, what, 20 something you said? And you got it in like three? All right. It does rotate. So when the claw goes down, it like spins around. It looks pretty good. As long as it, oh, that one, oh, it didn't. So that one didn't spin that time. Okay, try one more time. One more time. I know you don't want to, but try for the one in the back. Because if you get in the headband, you're gonna win it. You could you could even trade it out for one of those little uh, hamsters. The pooey pooey, I think it is. Alright. Just don't rotate too much. Yes? No! No, you didn't get in it! But I think you totally could, but let's just play some more machines, right? We could be on that thing all day. Oh, that was exciting. I enjoyed that. Yes, you have one from this in the past. Yes, I have. Do you want to try it? Yeah, I kind of do. Yeah, because you can actually trade it for one of those back there. Because yeah. I think we have actually won all these since we've been here. But that Eeyore looks so cool. I know. It's so good. It's the Alice in Wonderland cat. Oh, yeah, the Cheshire cat. Is that yeah, the name yeah. of it? Okay. And I like that uh, that Mickey back there. The Mickey. Oh, gosh, you didn't get. Oh, you, you moved it. You, like, turned it, though, but okay. you didn't move it much. Are you going to do another one? Oh, come on. You can get it. Are you going for the head? All right, she's gonna try to grab the uh, alien by the head. Maybe I have to go for that duck one. Ducky? Yeah, that one right there. Yeah, it, eh, it might. Here we go. Good luck. Yes. Right, Looks that's good. Better, that's better. Do a good drop. Do good drop. Ah! Oh, that was actually a very bad drop. <laughs> that was a terrible drop. Hey, look at this uh, poo. Yeah. It looks. Wait, does this look? Am I seeing something here? What? That poo is taller than the claw. Well, let me try it. I think you can. Uh, I think you can drag this one. Okay. You know what I'm talking about? Like, yeah, drag it. like just like get behind it without dropping it and yeah. try to. Oh gosh! No! 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 Oh gosh! Can you hit it? Oh wait! Oh. Come on, come on, you have, you only have like a little bit of time. You only have a little bit of time. Oh no! Oh gosh! That's not what we were trying to do. Maybe we were wrong. Oh like this! Let's go drag it. Oh no! You know what you did? You picked it up and pushed it further back. Oh, we only have like I think one more play left of um tokens on us. No, that's not what we want. Oh, you remember when we showed the Kooji claws? Some people said I had no idea what a Kooji is. I never explained it. I just assume people know what a Kooji claw is. But if you're watching this video and you don't want to know what a Kooji claw is, 
Akuji is like a Japanese lottery for like toys. You always try this on every time you were here. Okay, this is like your last play, right? Okay, so she has one more play after this. I hope you win, honestly. Yes. Crystal likes playing for the Demon Slayers. Good luck. Flip it. Ooh, you're gonna play it on this one? Oh gosh. I wanted to play another machine. I wanted to play something. Crystal used all the tokens. It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Is that gonna flip it in? Flip it. Flip it. Oh my. You have to get more, Chris. You cannot leave that like that. Crystal is back. She's so excited. Hey, but now since she went and got more tokens, I gotta play some, right? Eventually, at some point. What if it bounces to the back? You never know. Hey, it did not bounce to the back. You cannot blame it on me. Oh, you're done? Oh, yeah, it's probably a good thing because uh, you could probably play that one for a long time and it not go anywhere. <laughs> All right. Which one? Um, I'll let you know when I see something I want to play. I don't see anything right this second that I want to play. But let's see. Let's take a look around. Ooh, Pokemon. I love playing for the Pokemon machines. Even though we never win from Pokemon machines, I still like to play them. Ooh, I like to play that one over there, too. That one's a fun one over there. I like that one as well. Oh, that's a big head right there. But that machine over there. No, you can play it for me. Ooh, you gotta get that Slowpoke. Ooh, or you can get the Totodile. Oh, actually, I think we might keep the Totodile. Really? Yeah. So Crystal playing is like she's playing for me. What is it? Yes, that's Totodile. Oh, gosh, you hit the tail. Oh, oh. Flip it. Flip it to the left. Oh, I, okay. Actually, I do want to play this one. Maybe Angel will win this. I hope he can. Don't spend too much. Oh. Yes. See, I kind of went more to the left. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh goodness. He brought his big head closer to the prize sheet, though. That could be good. Yeah, but it also could be bad. It could be bad. You don't well. know. <laughs> spin, spin. Yes. Win, oh. win. Oh, come on. This is way closer, no. closer to the left. It's rotating. Oh, goodness. Oh, yes. goodness. Yes, it's kind of close to the, the, um, the glass. glass right here, but it's still, it's still in a good spot. I don't want to right, go He's going for the head. He's going for the head. Yes, yes, yes. No, 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 no. no. Okay, that was... Oh, hey, you want a ball. You want a ball. Hey, look, it says I won. <laughs> Angel, you're so excited to win a ball? <laughs> it's actually not good because it reset payout. Oh, man. Yeah, so we don't want it to win a ball. Yeah. But that's okay. Okay, yeah, that, looks, that looks better. Yes. Oh, oh, but it really wasn't, though. Okay, I'm going to do it one more time. All right. Because I think it might be too close to the glass now. Yeah, you have to go further back, too. Oh, I have to go a little bit or back. Or further to the right, I mean. No, I, I think it was good. I just stabbed this. Okay. All right, here it goes. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Come on, come on. It Wait, might be good. It might be good. Want, oh, oh no. goodness. Oh. oh, no. So we are going to play one last machine, and it's this cherry blossom theme machine because it looks so cool. It looks and it also ties in well with something else that they have here about Cow Play Kamu. It's really cool. So they have these pop-up shops. Yeah. And you might be thinking, what, what, how does an arcade have a pop-up shop? I, I thought it was strange too. Yeah. So they have these little pop-up shops that you can use your tickets from the arcade yes. to redeem for the, the stuff, the merch. Oh, you moved the, uh, the piglet okay. a little bit. So like they, there's one that is Sanrio themed. Yeah. So yeah, fun. then there's another one that's Marvel and I think uh, um, um, Disney theme. Yeah. yeah, Marvel and Disney. They look really cool. And then they have this other pop-up that I think is just for photos. Yeah. We're going to show that like probably after we show the prize area. Yeah. Because it's basically an extension of the prize. Oh, gosh. Oh, oh, yes. But it's basically an extension of the prize area. But it look, it's so cool. Yeah, exactly. I thought it was so neat. It's like next level amazingness. They actually, let's see, they have one, two. They have three of them because the Mickey one. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't think we're going to show that one because that's like on a whole other side of the mall. Yeah. Like, it's so far away, but it's really neat that you can use your tickets to get your prizes. Yeah. Like, that is so cool, in my opinion. Oh, oh yes. Whoa! Oh, it almost went in. Oh it almost went in. We might have to play until we win this now. You might have to win this, Chris. I know, I know. Oh, but it's so, I think it's so cool, guys. But, okay, let's see. Can Crystal win? Yeah, when you guys see the merch in the pop-up stores, you guys got to freak out because I know I did. Yeah, it's like official merch. Yes. And that's what's cool about it. And they were telling us that they actually change it with the uh, 
whatever the season, not necessarily the season, but they change the themes, kind of. Come on, come on, yes, yes, that's good, that's good. Oh my gosh, that is so good. One more, and then we're gonna get more tokens, that's all I know. You have that thing so close, you have to win it. Oh man, yeah, because, oh, sure win is 25 on this one. And you're barely on your fifth play. If you can win it at half, I'll be happy with that. But if you can't win it, oh, like that was a, I thought that was a bad one, but this, oh gosh, you have to get more. I don't think I've ever seen Crystal move as fast as she did just now, guys. Wow, she was moving like lightning. I hope, I hope it's worth it. I hope that run was worth it. Don't spin it, don't spin it, don't spin it. No, spin it the wrong way. It's so close, maybe only a few more because it's getting close, but I, I just don't know if it's gonna actually go in. Yeah. Because it keeps hitting that edge. I know. It's just barely hitting the edge right there, and that's just enough to bounce it off. Right you might get that good hit on the edge, though. You never know. Yeah. Oh, come on. How do you feel about this one? Uh, not good, not good. Oh, oh I, I don't, hey, you knocked the other one down. Look, the other one's sad for you. We have to take a break. <laughs> so would you keep the piglet, or would you go for the poo? Uh, well, that's a good question. I really don't know. I feel like the poo is larger. Yeah, you're right. And I like the shirt that's on poo. Oh, by the head. I think the head grabs are, yes. Ooh, ooh, okay. What play number are you on? I am on play number eight. No, you're on number nine. This is number nine. Sure win is 25. If you can win this at tw before 12, that is amazing. Oh, yes, oh, please, no, no. That was, no, but it might hit in it. Yes, this is it, this is it. Yes, you got it, you got it, you got it at nine plays, at nine plays. Oh, it has Beanie at the bottom. Oh, my God, oh. oh yes, oh, that's another thing. Crystal's shirt is actually from one of the pop-ups here. so I'm telling you guys, the merch is insane. Right, that is so awesome. Look, you got Piglet and you got Pooh, so you have to make a decision. Are you gonna take Piglet? But the Pooh has the same thing. That's what I think so because the poo is a little bit bigger and it has that cool shirt. So don't mind Crystal just trading out her piglet for the really big poo. But this is the one that I said is like a photo shoot little section because it's like made for photos. On camera it looks really like yellow but in person it doesn't look that yellow. It's just this, it's the lighting. Lighting is weird here. Hey look, it's poo and piglet. What in the world? This is perfect. Like I love this area. Let me actually show a little bit over here before we go to the prize area because I want to show this. So this is the entrance. You walk in, you see the cherry blossom trees, and then you see just Disney stuff oh everywhere. My God, it's beautiful. Yes, it is. You got the Dalmatians over here. You got Bambi over there. You got Crystal right here with her poo. Yes, with the tree. She loves that. On this side, they have some Tsum Tsums, Stitch, Tigger, uh, Pooh, Eeyore, um, Dale or Chip, actually. Right. This is so cool. I love how cool it looks. And like they j actually just finished this by the time we um, put this video up. Yeah. Like the last couple days they put this all together. All right, let's actually go look at the prize area now. So then we can look at the other pop-up shops. Now we're headed down. Pooh's just waving right there. <laughs> what the world? Get out of here, Pooh. But see, I'm telling you guys, this looks really cool when you're going down. So we made it to the prize shop. I know all of you have been waiting for this moment. At least some of you have been waiting. Check that out. That is crazy. Too bad that's not a prize, but you can still get a miniature version of it right here. It's the same thing, but in a smaller scale. I think to get this golden one, you have to buy this right here. Oh yes, you can get the standard version right here, the uh, non-variant one. That one still looks cool with all the golden coins. Look at this stuff. Look at this little carrying case for your um, headphones. You yes, you really could. Like, look at this guy. He looks familiar. You know him? I think his name's Iron Man or something. <sighs> that is so cool. It's not a prize, I don't think. I mean, it'd probably be so many millions of tickets. I don't even want to think about. This is so cool. Like Crystal said, we could go through this prize area a hundred times, two hundred times, and still find something new. We've actually gone through this prize area. I can't even think how many times, and every time Crystal's like, look at this, look at this. So we're on one side of it right now. There's another uh, other half of the prizes over there. And then not to count the uh, pop-ups, those are like extensions of the prize area. So Crystal, of course, comes straight to the Rilakkuma stuff. 
and the uh, Sumiko stuff. Of course, that's where you were head. Where'd you go, Crystal? I'm lost. I'm scared. Oh, oh my gosh, it's kind of cramped right there. Ooh, we got a Hello Kitty like pops right here. Oh, what is this? Is this Hello Kitty as well? I don't know what this is, but it is a stuffed toy. And then they have the uh, conveyor belt, not conveyor belt, but the uh, like thing going around the uh, whole arcade over there with all the uh, different stuffed animals that you can redeem for. They have a lot up there. Where are we going, Chris? You're, you're taking me on an adventure. Oh, check that out. Hey, we never made it to this part of the arcade. No, we didn't come to the back back here, but check it out. They got a BB-8. Isn't that cool? Oh, and then this section. We didn't show this. So this is actually where you eat your tickets. You know, you add up all your tickets and get the uh, the points and everything. Yeah. But this is the cool part. Oh, look how cool it is. How neat. Go over there for um, scale. Yeah. So Crystal's five foot tall, just so you guys know. Look at Buzz Lightyear. You're the same height as Buzz Lightyear. So anytime someone asks you how tall you are, you say, I'm one Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. It's got Woody over there. It's got Bo Peep. Bo Peep, and it has a sheep. What are the sheep called? Just called sheep? Sure, we're calling them sheep, but yeah, this is the area where you like eat all your tickets. It looks pretty cool too, not gonna lie. Yeah. But we're here for the prizes, okay? Yeah. Let's get back to the prizes. So many prizes. They have a lot of Lego sets. Like, check out that Lego set right there. Then they have these over here. They're so big. I don't even want to imagine how long it takes to put something like that together. All the Nerf guns over here. I know. Like, we're we're just we're trying not to spend too much time in here, and we could literally. Spend hours in here. Demons, oh my gosh, I'm, oh, what the, what is here? What is this, actually, what is this? This is a, I don't know. Uh, let's put it back, because we don't know what it is. They got some cups, I think that's like cards, or, or it's an eraser. They have a Nezuko up here, is it? I think it's a plus. Demon Slayer talking, it says plus. Uh, it's a plus. It's a plus. <laughs> they, they couldn't put the extra letter on there, I guess. There's some Toy Story over here. Oh my gosh. What is it, Toy Story? What is it? What is it? Red. Where? Right there. I'm looking. Oh, what? he's right here. I've never what? Seen that before. What is that? Oh, Are there different? Red. Oh, there's another character. Oh, Crystal's just obsessed, um, like uh, excited about the Sid right here. Oh, my God. oh, what is this? I see some aliens. What is this? Can I, can I rotate it? Oh, look at that. Oh gosh, I don't want to drop it. Can you hold that for me? Thank you. Alien big solar swing. So it must swing. Okay, let me actually get that out of your way. Oh, what is this? Another alien. Yeah. Oh gosh, there's so much cool stuff. Oh, but these look so cool. I think we showed these in the uh, the other video we did. Yeah, so they're, they're little blind boxes, remix blind boxes for the aliens. But it has Swarovski. Did I say that right? It has the gems in them. So you see like little stones. Oh my gosh. Those are so neat. Just a Toy Story section. What? Look at all this Toy Story stuff. What in the world? You're right, Crystal. We could stay here all day just yes. looking at the Toy Story stuff. Oh, oh. Stained glass? What? Ham. You, what? Ham? A lovely pig? Oh my god. So every time you tell me to go ham, you're telling me to become a lovely pig? Yes. <laughs> oh, I take that as a compliment now. It's Pumbaa. Look at Pumbaa. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh wow. They have really big versions of the uh, Savarsky things. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Savarsky. I don't even know how you say it. I don't know how you say those stones, but that's what I'm talking about. Oh, it's a lotso. Oh, look at the size of that lotso. Oh, these are the ones with the stones. These are the uh, Savarsky things. Oh, look at, it. look at that for me. What in the world? Okay, let's actually go to the other side because we could stay here all day. This side of the prize area is much smaller. It's just like this really compact little area over here. Crystal goes straight. You go straight to the shirts. Because they're SpongeBob and it's the cute chibi version. These shirts are absolutely amazing. Crystal actually has at least this shirt, I know. Yeah. Besties for resties. Oh man. And then they have some more shirts down there. Some Sesame Street stuff. Look at this. Look at this cookie monster. How cool is that? Come on. What? I love this. Minions, a lot of minion stuff here. I think these are probably like the coolest figures yeah. that like anywhere. Yeah. Because not only do they have like the small, really look nice the ones, they have a Dumbo right here. Guys, look at that Dumbo. If you don't freak out seeing that Dumbo, you are crazy. Then you are a Dumbo. <laughs> but check out Ariel. Yes. She's so like it's so big and like so detailed. Oh my God. Yeah, Stitch is just doing a little dance over there. It's probably about a foot and some inches tall. This looks nice. The robe looks really good. 
And then we have the alien on the ride. How, how awesome is that? I totally want this, but it's a lot of tickets, like over 300K tickets, and we don't have that many tickets. So this is where you actually get the Dumbo's right here. Crystal's just like admiring everything. Yeah. Oh, look at these. They have something for everyone, like for every fandom. They have a lot of Disney stuff, which is so different than what we have back home, you know? Back home, do, do any of the prize areas actually have much Disney at all? No, Not no, really, no. right? You got it. Here on that flip, Mickey! Right? Mickey, you, got you got it. If you like Legos, they got it, right? If you like whatever this is, they got it. Where? Oh, this one? I remember we tried to win that in Japan. And I don't think we won it, but we tried a lot. I almost forgot to show these. These are awesome. They're, they're tall. Like, this is probably, what, three feet tall? The, uh, let me actually back up so you can see Crystal next to it. It's about three feet tall, two and a half, three feet. The alien, look at the alien! Isn't that one fantastic? Oh, that one is awesome. We need that alien. So this is one of the Disney pop-ups that they have here, and they have Disney prizes. Like, what would you expect? You know, you expect Disney prizes in a Disney pop-up. Yeah, and see, it has the ticket value on it. But it also has the, uh, the price of it as well, if you want to buy it. Like it has, this was in the claw machines over there. Those down there were in the uh, goblet toss from the poo, yeah. right? And then inside in this, um, this section of it, they had the little Tsum Tsum characters that you can put in the jars. But I think that's so neat, right? And then on the other, there's like actually another part, like right over there, they have t-shirts, they have comforters, they have masks, they have, they have like so much different stuff for like Disney. What else was it that you said they had Marvel? Yeah, they had Marvel shirts. Yeah, Marvel shirts, a whole bunch of them. Yeah, so it's, isn't that neat though? Yes. Like you can come over here, you can like, oh, I don't want to go to the arcade, so let me just buy this and you can buy it. Or you're like, hey, let me get it with tickets. It actually doesn't say tickets on this one. Oh, it's right up here. So the ticket values are like right here up top. So you can buy it or you can play and try to win it. And here is the Sanrio section. Oh my gosh, look how beautiful. Look at Pom Pom Perrin. I am freaking out, guys. When I saw this, I was like, what in the world? I cannot believe it. They have so many Sanrio things in here. They have Pom Pom Perrin pillow, Kachako. OMG, like, if you're not freaking out about this, you are crazy. I'm crazy. He has a Gudetama snacks, OMG. Look at these keychains. There's so much in here. You guys know that I love to shop for kawaii things, and they even have dishware. They have mugs. They have bowls. They have so many amazing things. you see the Gudetama things. over here? Look at this Gudetama. Oh my god, this is so amazing. And the coolest part is you can redeem your tickets for this. I know, this. I still think that's like crazy. Me like, too. You don't need to go shopping at the store for your um, plates. I you? know, nope. just have fun and then get what you want at the end. All right guys, so that is where we're gonna end this video. We saw the arcade, we saw the claw machines, we saw the prize shop, oh and we God. even saw the pop-up shops. So amazing, like where does it end? Oh, I forgot, we played carnival games. Oh my God. This arcade literally has it all. Yeah. I'm not just saying that because we're sponsored, guys. Yeah, it literally game. has everything. Yeah, this arcade is literally amazing. Yeah, we do want to thank Cal Play Calmu again for sponsoring this video. We do appreciate you guys having us back. It was a lot of fun. And we hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, everyone.